Hey, what's going on, guys? This is me, whoever you want to call me, because honestly, yeah, I've changed my YouTube name so much that I can't even keep up with my YouTube name. But honestly, I am talking about hey, and the first person I'm going to be talking about in this video, I'm going to go on a little rant here, is Danielle Cohen. Now, I have talked about her in my Musical.ly video, but that just does not speak the words I have for her. Now, as you can tell, like, even one second of her musical, he's like, I just can't stand. But hey, who can understand or stand my musical, right? No one can, honestly, just no one can. Most of the musicals are just for embarrassing yourself again. But it's just like, I can't, I just have this feeling about her. Like, just she was bad news, just really, really bad news. And I do not know why, honestly, I just do not know why. Maybe because she seems stuck up. Yeah, that's probably the thing. She seems stuck up to most people. But I do have to say, some people think, like, everyone on Musical.ly is talentless, which isn't really true because, like, I dance, and, like, I dance. I met some people that other, other people that dance, and basically it's just, like, most people have a talent on there, but a lot more people than most do honestly have no talent at all like her in her bio it states that she's an actress um she won pageant of something wait let me pull it up here really quick okay so it says she's a model actress miss florida 2015 features 29 and proud loser and just just tell me what does it think to you like do you think it just sounds a little bit too much that she's bragging mostly because i looked up Danielle Cohen, actress, and I did not find anything. All I found was, oh, she's a muser. She won Miss Ward in 2015, and blah, 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 blah. I did not see actress on there. She is a model, but I did not see actress on there. Now, is she lying about that? Because she did lie about stuffing her face, or her face, um, her shirt. If you don't know what it is, it's just stuffing your, um, bra line to make your boobs look bigger. Honestly, I do not know why anyone wants to do that. But hey, who knows? Maybe they want curves. Maybe they don't. But to me, honestly, I, I, I don't really want curves. I'm, I'm just saying this now. I don't really want curves. I, I like being skinny. I like being a twig. Um, just, just leave me alone. <laughs> but yeah, I basically looked her up. And I didn't see anything. I didn't see, oh, she stars in this TV show. She stars in that TV show. She stars in this. She stars in that. She's not an actress. Okay? And she's not an actress. Maybe she was in a play or two. But that doesn't mean she's an actress. Okay? Now, there could be some talents she has. But honestly, I just don't see them. She doesn't really um post any music leaves where she expresses those talents, like, is she trying to keep it a secret? Because, honestly, Musical.ly, um, was meant for just having fun lip-singing. But they also impl implemented songs for another reason, for recording yourself dance. Um, you can do a whole bunch of stuff on there. You could, you could dance, you could sing, you can game, you can live-stream on there. You can do anything. It's like YouTube, but a smaller platform. And, honestly, it's just... What? She honestly does not express any talent she has. It's like, like she, I have to say this: she's better than Jacob. She's better. She's worse than Jacob Sartorius, to be honest. Because Jacob Sartorius, this is my reason. He actually tries to do stuff. He actually has a bit of a talent in that of singing. Like, to be honest, I don't know why people say his voice is awful. Like, I don't, I don't really, I, I don't really, really see it because. His voice is not that awful. Would you rather have this singing? Hey guys, it's Cassie, me again. Oh my god. So do you guys remember that first time I, I sung my favorite song ever, Don't Ran My Parade for Glee? Like, oh my god, well now I'm singing my favorite song ever again. Truly, madly, deeply, and oh my gosh, I'm doing um I'm doing this for Glee! And he you guys tell me if I'm good or not, okay? I'm so excited, so please tell me, okay? Here I go. I'll be your dream, I'll be your wish, I'll be your...
Or would you have this singing? Selling with a hair tie. No makeup with some sweatpants on. You know I can always be that guy. You can think about me all night long. But I think you need something to think of me. Something that will keep you warm and show you we can be more than just this. Tell me, which person would you rather have be famous? That girl or this boy? <laughs> Honestly, we all would pick Jacob Sartorius. Like, we we would all pick Jacob Sartorius, let's be honest. On the mountain, I wanna be. <laughs> so yeah, tell me in the comments, who would you rather want to be famous? And to be honest, listening to his song again, it's not it's not that bad, honestly. It's it's not that bad. I'm I'm just saying this now it's not that bad. It's not making a big deal out of it. So by now we all pick Jacob Sartorius, right? Well, out of those two people, that girl I just showed you and Jacob Sartorius, we can all happily say they have a bit of a talent. Like they're trying to do something. Danielle Cohn, all she's doing is just making, like, cringy comedy skits on Musical.ly. It's, it's not... Th and the reason... The thing is, it's not even her own comedy skits. At least I, like, try to throw in a little bit of, like, me making fun of a song or something on Musical.ly. No. She she just goes ahead and steals other people's sounds, but that's why they make them, honestly. But... Yes, there's nothing wrong with that, but she does. She literally has no talent. She's not doing anything. She's literally not doing anything, and she just came out with merch too. Really, you're trying to come out with merchandise when you have like 1.4 million fans? But guess what? The phone case was freaking twenty five dollars, and her T-shirts were ten or something. Honestly, what the heck? Like, what? Are you serious? Like, no one's gonna buy that. You're gonna make no money off of that. Because let me tell you a bit of advice. If you want to make money by selling stuff, put the prices a little bit lower so a lot more people buy them. So you can earn a lot more money than you would have just selling it overpriced. Because that's honestly how people would rather buy it. It's like No Man's Sky. If you want to make money off of No Man's Sky, well, honestly, just just just. But just make the price of like $25 for the game instead of 60 and a lot more people will buy it and try it out. But honestly, if like people don't like the game, they could just like, refund it or do something with it. But I honestly do not know. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. I was about to say leave a like. Um, blow up that like button if you did enjoy and you want me to make more commentaries like this. And I think I should be doing... I don't really know if I'm going to be doing live streams anymore, but I think, like, if I ever get the time to do a live stream, I will do a live stream. Trust me, I will. And, yeah. And to be honest, if you guys, I have honestly no, no problem with you doing Musical.ly's, but at least, like, if you're going to do Musical.ly's, at least express a talent you have, whether it's coding gaming or anything just express a talent you have because honestly if you're gonna go on musically you're open to criticism okay and some people do not know that mostly because they're like eight year olds and ten year olds because honestly there are stupid people out there like you can be smart and be young and that's most people but some kids they just know too much of the wrong things and they're just dumbfounded when they see criticism Yep, I guess that's why people talk down on 12-year-olds, but honestly, I'm one of those few 12-year-olds that I know much, but I actually just actually try to reason. I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm like the unsuccessful <laughs> Lieutenant Corbis, let's be honest, but I'm not, like, but she's like the more dirtier side of me, <laughs> but honestly, I, I have no, I'm nowhere near her, I'm honestly nowhere near her. <laughs> But I do have the mindset of her, but I just don't express that dirty side as much. But honestly, hopefully you guys enjoy it, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to school tomorrow, so I'm going to be uploading around this time this video gets put up. So I'm sorry about that, guys. 
but I should do some recording in the morning tomorrow when I wake up. And then I should um, do the commentary part, like, in the middle of the day. Or I should just, like, get on with Valeria on Minecraft and just, like, either live stream or just record a gameplay there. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! Click. We crash and then we fall. I'll be your hope, I'll be your love, be everything that you need. I love you more with every breath to me, madly, deeply do. I will be strong, I will be faithful, cause I'm counting. Amazing singing, huh, guys? Right? Uh, well, at least she's having fun, not gonna lie. At least she's having fun. A world where we're criticized for having fun, oh my god! But honestly, hashtag stomp hate of Daniel Cohen and Greenheart's fan Danny. Oh my gosh, no, please. That's just horrible.